What's up guys and welcome to a brand new Little Big Planet 2 DLC adventure. Today we're going to be playing through the Little Big Planet 2 Muppets Premium Level Kit. I'm so excited to do this one because it was the second most requested DLC to play through. The first was the Toy Story 2 level kit, which we just finished. I really do recommend you check it out if you haven't because it was such a great time. But now we'll be playing through the Muppets one, and this will be the last DLC that we'll be playing through before Little Big Planet 3 comes out, which is really exciting. Now, it will start us off by trying to make us play through the tutorials, but we won't be doing that right away. We'll actually be playing through all of these normal story levels first. Starting with, time to light the lights. Let's head in. Oh look, it's Kermit. Sack thing, one minute the curtain. Animal, what are you doing here? Uh-oh. Sack thing, sack thing, ah <laughs> Sack thing, friend, be careful with me. Animal, let him go. Please don't break our special guest, please don't. Animal, not break, animal loves sack thing. I'm an endangered species, please. 30 seconds, guys, oh, my, oh man, it's almost showtime. Sheesh, here we go. <laughs> uh, we'll be ready in time for the show? It looks like it. He's coming in front of the curtain. Welcome to this exclusive one-of-a-kind show, live from the Muppet Theater, with our very special guest, Sack Thing. Hooray! Oh, man. <laughs> hey, look. I'm the star of the show. <laughs> Me, Zebra. <laughs> Turn up the power, Beaker. I'm sure it's safe. Okay, just don't zap me. Me! No, it's going to be Beaker gets <laughs> zapped. Oh, look, we're rocking out with the band. <laughs> we are putting on quite the concert here. I love this. We got the chickens going on, and it's the band rocking out. Media Molecule. <laughs> awesome. Media what a cool Sounds like something I gotta get a doctor to fix. Hmm, I'm not sure if I like this new show. That's okay, you didn't like the old one either. <laughs> Who doesn't love the old grumps? The Muppets, awesome! Can't wait to start this Muppet adventure. Hooray! And now for our first act. Oh boy, Muppet Labs. Okay, Kermit walks off stage. Oh, we're in a laboratory. Dr. Bunsen Honeydew here at Muppet Labs, where the future is being made today, and now we have to, the answer to all your walking problems. Attract a gel. Oh my, Beaker. Meep, meep, meep. <laughs> You're stuck on the ceiling. Beaky, this is no time to fool around. Come down this instant. <laughs> it will be hours before I get him down from there. Darn it, Beaky. You and your Tom Fullery. <laughs> Uh-oh, oh, there he goes. Okay then, that was a really fun little opening. Now time to hop into the first level, Pigs in Space. Let's head in. Oh man, look, it's a crowd of sack boys, except for that guy back there, he was really angry. And now, Pigs in Space. Hooray! You know, in space, nobody can hear you scream. Can they hear you boo? <laughs> well, I sure hope so. <laughs> boo! <laughs> the SS Swinterex drifted off course and is lost in space. Will this ma mean curtains for the crew and their new space cadet? Sack thing? Uh-oh. In this episode, Swintrek crew members Hogthrob and Strangepork are at the Remedial Space Cadet Seminar. Filling in for them is Lieutenant Gonzo and Ensign Fro... Fro... Fozzy? <laughs> That's the last time we use Honeydew's new cruise control system. Wait, something big is showing up on the swine scanner. It's an asteroid. Oh no. Brace for impact. <laughs> it's so weird seeing the Muppets on a space adventure. Oh no, they fell. Uh-oh. Mion do, we've lost the engines. Have you checked under the space couch? I don't know if there is a space couch. Sack cadet, get over the engine room, pronto. 
Okay then, looks like our adventure begins. It's on the upper deck. Move it or lose it, Buster. Uh-oh, I don't wanna lose my upper deck. <laughs> okay then, so this is really cool. Now I do have to be honest, I don't know much about the Muppets. Now I know some you know, basic stuff, you know, like who Kermit is, but besides, I've never really watched the Muppets before. Follow the shape of the curves using the left stick. Okay then, so I can, whoa, no way. Awesome, very cool. And press the jump button twice if you wish to detach yourself from the attracted gel. Whoa, very cool. Attracted gel isn't just a clever name, it's what it does. Get close enough to it and you'll be attracted towards it. Cool. Just like this. Awesome. This is a really cool add on. However, if you grab an object, the attractor gel will instantaneously release you from its grasp. Okay, then, cool features. So I can grab this and it'll let me go. Awesome. Then I can jump down here, get this big old button. <laughs> but yes, I've never really seen any Muppets. I was a big fan of Sesame Street when I was a kid, but Toy Story was like, I was really into it because I knew everything about Toy Story and I really enjoyed the movies. Here, I don't know much about anything, so it's a brand new, fresh adventure for me and hopefully you guys enjoy that. I thought it still would be really cool to play this through because there's a lot of cool Muppet characters. These teleporters always mess with my fur, I would think so. Hey, hey, the ship's malfunctioning. It's all gone wrong. Hey, how'd you get out of there? Oh no, what happened? They got squished. Oops. Oh, she's still alive, okay. They just don't make spaceships like they used to. <laughs> they probably don't, uh-oh, uh-oh, oh, man. I almost thought I was going to be toast there. I really did too. <laughs> it took me a second to realize I was attracted gel. Okay, then let's all hop on down here. Cool, this is a really fun adventure so far. We're on this really cool spaceship. All right, then let's, whoa, we're getting launched up here. I wish I knew that was gonna happen or I would've stayed down there for a little bit more to collect more. <laughs> oh well, it's okay though. All right, then let's see how much we can collect here. Oh, I'm being thrown all over the place. It's sort of hard to expect where you're going to go. <laughs> all right, then let's go here. Come on, Oh, there we go. Awesome, this is fantastic. All right, let's fly up here, uh-oh. Oh no! You'll never finish the act, sack thing, it's Bagface. I don't know who the heck that guy is. Is he a Muppet character? <laughs> but yeah, I have a quick question for you guys. Did you guys grow up for, with the Muppets? What do you guys think of the Muppets? Do you think it's cool? Do you watch it? Or maybe you're a fan of Sesame Street or something like that. Feel free to let me know what your childhood television show was. I'm really interested to see. You know, personally, my favorite television show when I was a kid was easily Rugrats. Oh, it looks like we got the challenge key, very cool. Let's go down here and see what this one's gonna be. Uh-oh, uh-oh, no, death, not death. Let's hop down here, though, because I wanna see what this is. Uh-oh, how are we gonna do this? This is a little wonky. It's almost like the uh, anti-grav from uh, Toy Story 2 that we just did. <laughs> okay, then, uh-oh, what is that? Oh, it's one of the pigs. Sheesh, this really isn't my day. Maybe it isn't. I'm sorry to hear that, buddy. Hopefully your day gets better. Okay, then. So maybe I can do a bit of this and land way over here and then get a bunch of cool stuff. Look at all this. Okay, then. Getting all these cool letters. Okay, cool. Get this one as well. Awesome. <laughs> we seem to be making really great progress so far. So yeah, like I said, this will be the last DLC adventure we do before Little Big Planet 3 releases. Not to say that it'll be the last ever, because we might go back and do some of them if we please, but for right now, it'll be the last one. Hey look, it's Animal, he's throwing up some stuff for us. Thanks a bunch, Animal. You're our homeboy. <laughs> and an Animal Face, hooray! Uh-oh, there goes Bag Face. Oh, where are we now? taking the scenic route to the engine room, sack cadet? Hmm, mm, I don't know. More like we're sort of forced to take this way, but okay. So are we supposed to go this way, or are we supposed to go the other way? What is to the right then? Is there anything? It's a times two area, which I can't complete because I'm a lonely zebra. No, it's okay, it's okay. Okay, oh man, let's go. Oh man, ah, oh, ah, no, the pain, it's unreal. So I may or may not have <laughs> flubbed up a bit and I am on my last life. Hopefully we run into a new checkpoint soon or I will have to start this whole level over. Okay, there we go. Oh, that was, that's a close one. I, I didn't want this to be a horrible start. <laughs> okay then, looks like we have to jump over to this one. Come on, we can do it. Run, I gotta use my zebra legs and run. <laughs> Striped power. <laughs> All right then, so I can jump here and do I have that checkpoint unlocked? There we go. Uh-oh, oh no, I didn't get up there quick enough. Get it, get it, get it. There we go, I'm coming for you, Bagface. I don't wanna know what his real name is, but I like calling him Bagface. Okay, come on, jump through all this. Oh no, that was weird. Okay, 
Let's try that again. We got all the collectibles this time, so hopefully this time won't be that much of a problem. Hey, look, we get a piggy ear. <laughs> all right, looks like we're going up this way. What's down here? Nothing, okay. Gotta make sure, you gotta make sure you got all those nice collectibles. Okay, I'm gonna bounce off of here. Nav seven, I wonder what that means. Uh-oh, it's him again, caught you. Uh-oh, he caught us. No! Uh-oh, this isn't good. We're falling all the way down back into the space area again. Okay, interesting. Hmm, where am I falling off to? Wow, I'm going like all crazy different places. Okay, come on, come on, come on. Oh man, where are we even going right now? This is like crazy anti-grav stuff. We gotta be careful, we don't wanna get hit by this electric ball. That wanna be good. All right then, let's try to get over here. Awesome. Making some good progress. This is crazy scary too though. It's like I don't wanna die in space. I, I mean, how am I even able to breathe right now? I guess we learned that last episode too, or last DLC pack, that zebras can breathe in space. They are interstellar beings. <laughs> All right, there we go, come on. No, I got electrocuted right before the checkpoint. Oh, there was one right here though, that's pretty nice. Okay, no, oh, that is a difficult jump. It's like a little wonky. It, it's definitely a bit of a challenge to get used to the attractor gel. So let's uh, hop over here and hopefully this will throw us towards where we wanna go. Oh, it looks like it is, okay. Hooray! Uh-oh. Looks like more action. How am I gonna get up there? Oh, I see. We have to use this crushinator thing, sort of as like a platform, as you can see. Oh no, it didn't really work. No. Maybe I just have to jump across real fast. Ready, go. Hooray! That worked. Okay, so far, so good. Now go over here and grab onto this and launch. Ha ha! So, so far so good, like this is a really cool adventure. Maybe moi should have told you about these teleporters beforehand. Oh yeah, well duh. The generator seems to be intact. Okay then. Oh no, a bomb. I just need to flip this switch and we'll be. Oh no. <laughs> He's really a sourpuss, the guy in the back. This isn't part of the script, oh no. Oh, Kermy, why is this happening to us? Is somebody attacking the play? I don't know, Piggy, sorry. You don't know? We'll find out now, frog. Oh no, it looks like this play is under sabotage. That's not good. I've gotta admit, I've never seen anything like that before. Me neither, and I hope I never see anything like it again. <laughs> They're always so negative, but it's such a funny negative. They're so witty too, but there we go. This level is completed, fantastic. Which wins us a whole bunch of cool stuff. All right then, so that is the first level in the Fantastic Muppets Adventure. In the next episode, we'll be continuing on by doing the Great Gonzo. In the meantime, I'd love to thank you guys so much for watching, and if you enjoyed the video, please consider giving it a like and sharing it with your friends and family, because your support truly does help. Also, comment in the comment section below what you thought about this first episode of the Muppets Pack, along with answering my question, what was your childhood um, TV show that you enjoyed the, um, the most? And did you watch Muppets and enjoy it? Thanks for letting me know. Thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye-bye.